Looking for the latest juice in the world of entertainment? Look no further. You are about to be served. This is NX Daily Top 5 Entertainment. At number 5, Vodafone Ghana Music Awards gets interrupted as Shatawali and Stoneboy had gun face off. Ghana's biggest music night, which held on Saturday, ended in gun face off between Ghana's music stars Shatawali and Stoneboy. The face off started when the dance hall artist Shatawali cast a scene at this year's Ghana Music Awards after his arrival, and label mate Stoneboy was announced as the winner for the Reggae and Dance Hall Artist of the Year. According to videos from the award night, five times winner of the award, Stoneboy pulled out a gun while his fellow musician Shatawali retaliates. This, however, did not dampen the night as Burner Boy won African Artist of the Year, Kitty Takes Male Vocalist of the Year, and Sakodie bags home the artist of the decade. At number 4, ex-BBN housemate turns businesswoman as she launches new clothing line, Siga. Following up on the several Siga clothing launch, ex-Big Brother Niger housemate Cynthia Wadiora, better known as CC, has decided to add the Siga sport clothing line to our clothing line for women. She launched the line in an event which was hosted by Uti Nwachuku and Vandora as the red carpet host. The event also had BBN housemate Nina Ivy and Anika in attendance. The collection was inspired by the difficulty to find fitness wears for herself as it features biker, shorts, hoodies, tights, sports bras and more fitness wears. Despite being the most aggressive housemate in the double Wahala season of Big Brother, CC is definitely on the rise to the boss lady pinnacle. At number 3, Pato Rankin sets to release his new album, Wima. Following his polarizing debut album, God Over Everything, in 2016, Pato Rankin is set to release his much anticipated album, Wilma, on the 24th of May 2019. The album, which has 12 tracks, including 6 collaborations, features artists like Davido, Bera, Daju, Yashiski, Busizwa, and Duneo. In an Instagram statement announcing the release of the album, the 28-year-old musician wrote, I've put my heart and soul into this album. Wilma has purely been a blessing and I hope this project encourages you, motivates you and blesses you. The journey hasn't been easy but we are thankful for where we are headed. God bless every single one of you and everyone who has been a part of this masterpiece. The album is named after his daughter Wilma and is now available for pre-order. At number 2, Runtown to release new app, Tradition. After a semi-break and only an off and on activity owing to some label drama over the past 3 years, Nigerian singer Runtown is back with a new app titled Tradition. The Mad Over You crooner's new app will consist 6 tracks which is produced by Del B, Spells, El Pluto and Ransom Beats. This will include his 2018 single Unleash and a soon be released single titled Emotion. The EP will be released on the 31st of May 2019. At number 1, Zlatan releases single 4 days after his bill. After the anti graft agency, Economic and Financial Crimes Commission EFCC released Zanko Kruna's Latin Ibile, he released a music video titled Four Days in Okoti Ebo to address fake friends and those who snitched on him when he was in custody. The song was published on his Instagram page on Sunday, the 19th of May 2019. The fast rising artist advised snitches not to be quick to judge because nobody is holy. The title of the song Okoti Ebo is a street in Ekoi where the Economic and Financial Financial Crimes Commission EFCC office is located in Lagos. And that's it on NX Daily Top 5 Entertainment. For these and more, do follow us on our social media platforms at NGZ Extreme and you could visit our website, it is at www.nigz.tv.